What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? I am Agent Shu, and this is the Long Dark Episode 5. We are here at Desolation Point, looking over all the carcasses we have to uh, take care of, get all the meat and hide and all that good stuff off of them. We're calling this Season 1.2 because, well, if you've been following along, Season 1 didn't go so well. We only made it a few episodes in before uh, the long dark took us. But let's get to it. I First, I would really like to harvest these, ki these critters here because, well, we don't want them to go to waste. We want the hide and the guts so we can kit up before we travel. We're going to try to burn through that as fast as we can. I would love to get, uh, before I leave this area, I would love to get at least one wolf hide coat, if not two, but I definitely like the rabbit skin stuff. Uh, maybe it'll happen, maybe it won't. The, the next trip on our list is over to Coastal Highway, which is perfectly fine if we're not completely kitted up. That's cool. But let's do it. Let's go... I'm hoping to get a couple more deer today. That That's kind of my mission. We haven't visited the lighthouse yet, so we may head over there as well. But first, let's go out here. Let's see. Is there a bear? It is pretty cold. Maybe we might want to light this fire, but... Nah, you know what? How much time do we have? We need... I think it takes two hours to... Let's take this charcoal. I believe it takes two hours to harvest this to get the guts and the hide. Do we not? We don't have any wood. Uh huh. Okay. Well, I guess we're uh, we're not lighting a fire. We're just gonna wing it. Let's take the hide. Let's do it. Watching our cold. Oh wow! Look at that. It's draining fast. Oh, come on. All right, we got the hide. That's fine. So we can go back. Actually, you know what? I'm going to go inside here. I'm going to grab some coal. It's, actually, it's only the guts. That doesn't take all that long. So let's drop the hide here. Well, no, we're going to drop it inside. It cures faster inside. You can travel around with it if, if the, the weight isn't bothering you. I'm just going to leave it here because I have that wolf to go over and harvest as well. But I don't think... Oh, that's right. We can't use coal to start the fire. Ha ha. We need the we need a couple sticks just to get the fire going. I don't think I'm gonna bother wasting any on the deer though, because it's only the guts left. We'll start a fire over next to that wolf and uh, warm up while we're harvesting that. Not sure whether or not I'm gonna take the meat. I got tons of deer meat from last night's little hunt, so we might just leave the leave the wolf meat. I think we got the, there's plenty of torches laying around here. We might just. Grab a couple sticks from those torches and go from there. But we need the guts. We definitely need the guts. So let's see. Guts usually don't take all that long. Oh, it still takes an hour. It's probably because we're using the hacksaw. If we had a hunting knife, it wouldn't be nearly as bad. But it is what it is. All right. Any deer? Or sorry. Any uh, bears, wolves, predatory animals? All right, let's, we want to take this guy, we want to get these sticks. We only need one, but we'll take two. And then I think what we'll do, weather permitting, of course, is we'll take all that deer meat up to the lighthouse. That way we can set it outside, we can do, do a little bit of cooking. Yeah, let's do that. All right, let's... Fire up this torch. We'll get a fire going out here. I'd love it if another deer just decided to poke its head out for us. Preferably over by the lighthouse. That'd be even better, but it is what it is. So many crows in the air telling us where all the carcasses are. Oh, on come on, fire. You can do it. Oh, let's pick that back up. Got to light the fire. I'm not sure. Uh, I haven't experienced this. I assume fires keep bear away, or bear, yeah, bear away as well. Maybe they do. Maybe they don't. I just haven't experienced it firsthand. I know they do keep wolves away, but you got to kind of keep the fire in between you and them. 
I did get a wolf that jumped me at a fire not too long ago. Not on this uh, this run, but. All right, let's add a couple pieces of coal. Let's get the hide, harvest. Yeah, that warmed us right up, perfect. I was actually worried, I didn't check my heat, so. Okay, we got one hour there. Any bear, any bear? No, we're looking good. Let's add another coal. And we'll go bolt the guts, that's another hour. Oh, we need some food. We can't lose that well-fed bonus. I guess we could, but it'd be a shame to lose it now when we've got all this meat. All right, that got us pretty good. Should I go for the wolf meat? You know, I don't think I'm going to bother. I got all that deer meat. Well, I guess if I got the time. I got an hour and 14 minutes, so... Oh, yeah, absolutely. Then we'll just take it. It'll last us as long as the fire's going, so that's fine. Perfect. We're keeping nice and warm. Let's light this torch off of that. We'll run over to the deer. We'll harvest the guts. That'll work out perfect. As long as the bear's not hanging out, I'll take it. What's our weight at? Uh, 32 of 30. I say well-fed bonus. We haven't gotten a well-fed bonus, but I don't want to lose the potential. Am I hungry again? Astrid, stop burning all them calories. Can't be getting that close. All right, let's get these guts, and I'll probably do it in two trips. I'll take the hide and the guts up, and then I'll come back and get all the meat. I think I'm going to be too heavy if I go for both in one shot. No bear, no bear. One coal. That'll get us to the one hour. I will need some more sticks on the way, but that's fine. Uh, yeah. Let's do it. Harvest. I would really like to find that hunting knife. Harvesting the guts is so much faster with the hunting knife. Oh! Ha! Get away, bear! Holy shit! <laughs> no, don't do it! <laughs> the fire didn't save me! No! <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> oh, did I survive? How, how banged up am I? That's the question. Oh, how banged up am I? Blood loss, infection risk. Okay. But just how beat up am I? Oh, that bear got me good. Oh, I'm not doing so hot. Let's get to the ship. Did I at least get the guts? Stupid bear. I'm tempted to take a shot at him. You know what? Screw you, Yogi. Ah! Run! Back inside. <laughs> Oh, that bear's messed me up. Oh. All right, all right, all right. Let's calm down. All right, so we healed that. Let's get some antiseptic on our right leg. Oh, wow, that scared the crap out of me. Holy cow. Whew, my heart's like beating out of my chest. So we should be good, I believe. Let's see. I mean, my player's not doing so hot. I could... Whew, okay. So we could sleep for an hour, get a little bit of health back. Let's, uh... You know, I think we gotta boil some... Oh, do I have any tea? Let's see. I don't think I do. <laughs> Shot the bear in the butt. <laughs> oh, he shredded my clothes. How cold am I? All right. Well, I don't think I'm losing any health. Let's drink this water. And uh, unfortunately, all those clothes with the red X through them, they're trashed. So did I lose anything good? I lost my parka or my windbreaker. I lost my jeans, so now I'm running around in thermal underwear, and I lost my gloves. 
All right, so that kind of stinks. Now we got to kind of hope the lighthouse has something for us because, yeah, we're not doing so hot. I don't think... All right, we're going to light this fire in here. We're going to take some time, cook some food. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Do I even have any sticks to light this thing with? I got plenty of coal in here. Let's see. Take the charcoal, because that matters at this point. No, we don't. But I do have... I can break down one of these. Let's harvest this. We'll get some warmth in us. We're not losing any any condition. We're just a little... Uh, we're a little beat up. So... We're going to boil up some water. Oh, no. Let's start this fire here. Come on. Oh, no tinder. Um, any newspaper kicking around? No, no, no. No newspaper. All right, I guess we got to break down another torch and stick for some tinder. Uh, cloth? I'll take that because I'll have to make another bandage. <laughs> oh, this game's brutal. Don't pay attention for two seconds. And, you know... It, that bear, I may have looked right at it. Maybe it was a lot closer than I thought it was. Yeah. Right, let's go like this. We're going to break down another stick. Um. Oh, no, no. Oh, yeah, tinder plug. Let's do it. Craft two tinder plugs. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> oh, wow. My daughter's probably sitting in the other room going, what in the world is going on in there? Do I have... Oh, so I got a jerry can. I just don't have the... The lantern right now. The storm lantern. Whew! Alright. Episode 2. We're, we're doing great. Doing good. Got tons of deer meat. Only got attacked by one bear so far. <laughs> Oh, I swear if I go outside and there's a dead bear out there somewhere, I will I will feel completely happy with that. It, it, it's perfectly fine. I will feel vindicated. That was the word I was looking for. Come on, little fire. Come on. Even though there's no way that revolver... Oh, are you kidding me? I just burned both of those? Ugh! Killing me! Alright, maybe we'll find some paper up here. I can't really go outside because there's a very angry bear. I will have, once this torch burns out, I'll have another stick ready to go. But I'm running out of torches here. I've got no way to heal up. Alright, perfect. We've got some newsprint. That'll give us another piece of tinder. And, but I need... Oh no, I can break this down. 27 minutes to break down a piece of cardboard. Really? Just rip off a chunk. That's all you need. Alright, well this newsprint should do it. I think what I'll do is I'll get enough coal on here to get this water boiling and then I'll go sleep for an hour or two. That ought to work out pretty good because we can get some health back while the water's doing its thing and it's not going to we're certainly not going to get on. up to full health but it, it'll do something for us let's go fire come on ah oh, you're killing me this is brutal all right so we only got eight percent left on that we threw one over here right where are you Oh, where did I put it? Where did I put it? I started in the dark. It's going to end in the dark. All right, whatever. I guess this torch is burning out, and then we'll light the fire with matches. Let's, let's 
take a quick peek outside. Just, just a peek. Just a peek. All right, back inside. It's too scary out there. All right, what I should do, actually, you know what? I'm gonna drop. Uh, yeah, I'll do it right here. Drop all this stinky stuff. All the guts and wolf meat. So I can get rid of that. And I don't have any more torches. I guess I could use a flare. And I don't mind using the matches at this point. But we gotta get this fire going. and I, More or less because I'm sick of the listening to the heartbeat in my ears. Alright. Through the dark corridor we go. Can we? Can we make it? Alright, so that's it right there. That's right in front of me, right? Nope, that's a metal shelf. Alright, forget it. Wasting a torch. Oh, wait, no. Why don't I just use the matches? Derp! Oh, wait, that, that, nope, nope, nope. Craft the tinder plug first. Jeez. Oh, I'm still all jazzed up from that bear attack. I've only been attacked by a bear once before. Yeah, I think only once before, and I died very shortly after. Maybe it was twice. Either way, my experience with bears trying to maul me is not extensive. Let's go, fire. Come on. <laughs> Come on, Let's go for it. Come on. Come on. Almost there. All right, good. I can add some coal. We'll go with three. And then we can take a couple torches out. No, we don't want to cook. Let's do water. Oh, that's right. We don't have a cooking pot yet. Oh, no. That's all right. You can, if I put a bedroll down, I can sleep for an hour at a time while the water cooks. Recycled can, water, cook. Bedroll, one hour sleep. All right, that should get us a little bit of health back, enough to where my heart isn't beating in my ears anymore. And we should, with any luck, I, what time of day is it? All right, so that gave us enough water. Bedroll, pick up. Let's get some torches out of here. There's probably too much if I was only going to sleep an hour. I'm wasting all this coal, but... So the real question is, would it be more wise to crash here and heal back up? Or would it be more fun to make the trek over to the lighthouse, check that out while we're very low on health... And stinking like deer meat. Oh, we don't want that one. I think it would be more fun, but probably not the best idea. Alright, give me a good torch already. Jeez, really? Let's just go junk torch after junk torch. That's fine. We're gonna take. What's our weight? Our weight is 25. We can only carry 27. But, let's go. We want the guts. Let's get stinky. So, we don't want the meat. So, we're going to take this food and we are going to drop that. Drop the food. We got the guts. That's fine. And... No, Astrid. Deer meat is life. All right, Yogi. Or Death Bear, or whatever you want to call yourself today. Please stay away. Just keep your distance. Whew. What an eventful episode. You know, I probably looked right at it when I was looking around before I started the fire, and I just wasn't observant enough. Oh, there's the wolf, right? No, that's my fire. 
All right. All right, you tell me. If, if you spot a bear, let me know. Because I'd, I'd really like not like to run into him again. Let, let's avoid him for now. Let's just get to the lighthouse. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, I know on the approach to the lighthouse, I think past the first bridge, there's no wildlife there. But wolves will kind of harass you up on the approach. They, they make their way across it quite a bit. And it's got a big embankment on both sides, so unfortunately you don't see them until they're pretty much right on top of you. I have seen a bear up there at one point, too. Alright, what's that? Uh, nothing. I guess I could run. I don't know why I'm walking. I'm just real heavy. I wish there was like a back way up. I keep hearing like the wind hitting the torch or maybe it's the waves or, or something like that, but it's this kind of... Uh, just a strange sound, and I keep thinking, oh crap, there's a bear. Where's the bear? I guess I didn't have to go all the way around. I could have gone under the bridge, but... It's just me being extra cautious. Of course I'm out here. There's no sticks. I got a piece of reclaimed wood. I may actually, while I still have sunlight, I may end up going through the lighthouse and breaking down a bunch of chairs and stuff like that. But without any sticks, we're not really going to be able to make any tinder plugs. Okay. I can't survive you, so you're going to be a good boy, and you're just going to go away. No. Back off! Thank you. I don't want your wolfiness right now. I'm too delicate and fragile. No, don't go tell your friends. I'm not having a party. Yeah, oh, now you're brave again? Alright. Meet my revolver. You get! I shoot you anyway. That's just for talking to me or barking at me or whatever you want to call it. I will be back for your stuff later, sir. Thank you for your patronage. <laughs> All right, we can go up this hill. No wolves, no wolves. No bears, no wolves, no wolves, no bears. I stink to high heaven. I'm carrying guts and hide and meat. There's just... I'm, I'm amazed and... Nope, I'm not, I'm not even going to say it. Not going to say it. Nope, sorry. Mm -mm. I jinx myself. All right, let's go, Astrid. Get some of your stamina back. We're almost there. Alright, you're going to eat a granola bar safely. It's okay. We're almost to the well-fed bonus. You'll be fine. Alright, so I did pick up the bedroll, correct? Correct. Oh, there's a bed upstairs. I can use that if I need to. Okay, it's starting to get cold out. I got the deer meat. Okay. Oh, I'm all nervous. So close yet. I'm just like, oh, the worst is going to happen just before the door. I think we're good. We're good. Yep, sun's going down. It's starting to get cold. We'll get a good night's sleep tonight, that's for sure. Luckily, I don't believe uh, exhaustion does a whole lot of damage to you. I'm pretty sure you can be exhausted for an, a really long time before it really messes you up. Not so much with cold. <laughs> that tends to end you quickly. 
All right, I'm just coming down here. There's usually a corpse here, which today there is not. Okay, let's grab a rock. You yeah, know, rocks will save us. Come on. I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to get back up there for a second. Oh, I should have taken more coal from the boat. Man, here I was being extra cautious. Making sure there wasn't any wildlife around to chew on me. Alright, let's get some fuel to burn with. We got some firewood there. That'll come in handy. Oh, hey, those will replace the pants that Bear shredded. Uh, let's do... Well, that book won't work as tinder, though. Here, let's... Hopefully we get some newspaper or something. I may just have to throw a couple torches on the ground and let them burn out. I'll drink this water. Um, 30% uh, death milk? No. We'll go with another granola bar or nuts, whatever these are. And look at what's this. Uh, I will eat the granola bar as well. We'll be getting full on uh, deer meat here in a second. But we're not cooking yet. So I should drop the deer meat just for the sake of lightening up as I walk around drop this outside I guess and I haven't scienced this myself but if you drop the deer meat out in the snow either cooked or raw it lasts longer loses condition slower I don't have flare on the steps that'll work did I open this yeah I opened it the one thing I haven't done I've seen all the electronics light up and and all that but I haven't stopped to read the the messages that pop up on the laptops Oh, revolver ammo, that'll make up for the one that I wasted on the bear's butt. There's some newsprint. We can craft tinder plugs with that. Sewing kit to patch up some of our gear. More matches. Okay. The lighthouse is taking care of us so far. We got some chairs to break down. I don't think we can break down the table. I believe we need a hatchet for that. A hatchet or a hammer. But maybe we can with the hacksaw. I'm not sure. Uh, we'll come back for that. It's going to be a second before it burns out. Some scrap metal, whatever will take it. Book to burn. Is there anything behind here? Sometimes. I've found things behind these crates. What's that on the floor? Gun cleaning kit? More scrap metal. Scrap metal galore. Uh, worn hoodie. I don't know that that's gonna... Well, no, that, that goes on the inside of, like, your windbreakers. Oh, I can't believe that. That sucks. The worst part is, there just isn't much in this region. Unless I've missed a lot of it, which is... There's a good chance I have. Oh, wool scarf? Okay, okay. We're getting a little something. Need that outer shell. Where's the windbreaker? Rifle cartridge? And lantern fuel. Okay. Just need the lantern now. Because we got tons of fuel. I think we got almost four liters of fuel. Uh oh. Oh. Ooh. That was a little buggy there for a second. Let's go. Um, uh, I was looking for that torch that I dropped. I think it's on this landing. Yep, there it is. Keep that. We need the oh gloves. My my mittens got ruined, so that is welcome. I will take it. I know we can break down this shelf too. Nope, need a hatchet. Let's try to light the fire with what we got. Oh, we do have a tinder plug. Okay. If we get this going, we can get some meat cooking. We definitely need some water. 
I'm tempted to make a fire outside. Because if we can do that, then I can have two steaks going outside while I boil water in here, which would be really handy. Plus, the fires, if it's not too windy, actually last longer outside. Coal? Oh, we only have one coal. Alright. It's fine. That gives us 30 minutes. Let's put some water on here right away, because we have nada. While that water's boiling, uh, no, let's pick up this log. I'm gonna add that log. Because while that's boiling, I think we're going to break down this chair. Break that down. Okay, that's good. We're gonna add some more fuel. We'll do some reclaimed wood now. Just add all four of them. It's fine. Do some more water. And we'll break down that chair. 45 minutes to break down a chair. Yeah, see, now our health's starting to come down due to exhaustion. Oh, we got the, the heartbeats back. Okay, good. I did grab my bedroll. Well, then now, we'll take this. We got an hour 48. We're going to light a torch off of this. And. And start grabbing some meat anything right now. and the bigger pieces like so one kilo pieces take just about an hour to cook so we can cook sleep cook sleep cook sleep and that'll at least uh, raise our condition a little bit I know the longer you sleep the more your condition comes up all I really care like yeah so that's one kilo we got an hour 43 we'll snuff this all I really care is my heartbeat isn't pounding in my ears anymore. And we can do this like, what time is it? We can do it like twice. And then we're going to cook another one. We'll put, that's 56 minutes. And we'll add, what do we got to add to the fire? Some reclaimed wood. All right, we're at an hour and 38. We'll sleep for one more hour. So we at least have two cooked pieces of meat, and then we'll go for the long sleep. Sleep for the rest of the night. Try to get some of our health back. Perfect. So let's drink this water. We only have a liter. We need to boil more. Uh, how much reclaimed wood do we have? We have enough to cook another steak. No, but we do have enough for boiled water. So let's do another can of water. And while we're doing that, we will craft. No, we don't want to craft a tinder plug. We want to break down. Nope, not that. Uh, down here. Down there. I really should drop these guts. I can't be walking around with all this stuff forever. Otherwise, I'm just going to attract wildlife from every direction. Alright, we'll break those down. Another two minutes. <laughs> Day two. So I was attacked. Was I attacked by a wolf right off the bat? No, I don't want raw venison gamey. Or raw gamey venison. Oh. I can I can read words. All right, let's get our food up. No, we were attacked by a wolf right off the bat. Am I not remembering right? I think I've just played too many, died too many times to too many critters. So now my I'm getting all discombobulated. All right, now we're gonna sleep for. She's 10. Where's the bedroll? Let's go for 10. Maybe we can make it all the way, but the more the merrier at this point. We need to get some of this health back, and if we could find some herbal tea, then the next time I fall asleep, I'll really regain some health, but that did a really good job. That, that got us back up to at least a comfortable level. Alright, so we're going to pick that up now that we've got some daylight let's break some there was a chair up here we can break down for some wood 
Yep, let's break that down. Am I out of water? No, let's drink it. Drink it all. We can make more. And then what I think we'll do, if I can, is I'll step outside, get an actual fire going, so I can cook two pieces of meat at the same time. What's that? Uh, it's just a clipboard. A pallet. Now nope, I need a hatch. Oh, we can break these down. One hour, 30 minutes. One hour, 30 minutes. Uh, one hour. Let's break that one. It takes a ton of calories when you're breaking stuff down, though, so that, that's kind of a bummer. Whatever. We'll just keep doing it. We need the wood. All right. Did I unlock anything hidden on the floor here? No. Uh, uh, now let's break this one down first, and then I'll screw around with it. But if we're gonna, if I'm gonna be staying here for a little while, I really, I need the wood. Now I can go back to that transition cave for some coal, and I can also head up to the cave that heads towards uh, the wonderful, dreaded area, Pleasant Valley, and there's just a ton of coal in there. They're not Pleasant Valley, geez, sorry. That heads towards Ravine. There is a, a good amount of coal in there. It's not that long of a trek to get there. Considering our gear isn't in all that good a condition, it's probably longer than I would want it to be. But uh, beggars can't be choosers. And then if we need more, is the wind going to treat us nice? Let's come over here. Uh, newsprint? News roll. Newsprint. Let's do it. We'll get this Bambi meat cooked up, or deer meat. i got to quit saying Bambi. It's going to get me in trouble. Maybe it won't. I don't know. I'll get this deer meat cooked up. Venison. And we mm. can, uh, we'll at least have some meat. And I know there's a deer and rabbit spawn relatively close by. <sighs> So we might be able to go over there and hunt down one or two more. And the condition on these is low. All right, let's drop all of the meat. Oh, is this non-potable? Oh, yeah, it's on safe water. I must have taken it off too early. But we are going to drop the hides and the guts in here. Which I don't know why I haven't yet. Where do we want them? We'll put the hides over here. Craft. Whoa, we got us a wolf hide and a... Oh, did I not pick up that deer hide? Oh, no. Drank his own pee doesn't yeah, I left it right over now. in the other building. That's fine. As long as it's inside, it will cure. I'll just have to remember it's over there. Alright, let's get some more food. I'll do the peanut butter. That's got a lot of calories in it. And then we gotta do some water. How are these steaks coming? Ah, forget it, we'll pass the time. Hopefully the weather, do I only have one can or did I leave it inside? I probably left it inside. Uh, we're good on time. Oh, here comes the wind. Of course it's gonna blow out our fire. It's so one thing I don't like. Uh, okay, so I do only have one. I could have sworn I had two. Yeah, I guess I only had the one. Okay. Well, I'm sure I have a can of something that I can... Oh, wait, I don't have a can opener. Or do I? I don't know what I have. <laughs> I'm all screwed up. I do have a can opener. Okay, so what I could do is... Do I have any canned food? Yes, we'll eat the dog food. That'll give us another can. Make cooking water a little faster. Wow, dog food gives you a little bit of water, huh? It's that uh, it's that dog gravy. It's the good stuff. All right, let's speed that up. And then we'll add... We'll do some more water. We're just going to do a water session here. Add some fuel. And then melt it. Cook it. All right, let's get these in the sink. Water. Cook. Water. 
Are we burnt through? Oh wow, we burnt through the. Oh, that's right, because we we slept a really long time. Mm, I'm not gonna attempt adding more fuel because I'm. This wind's really starting to pick up. We might get lucky, but let's just keep trying to cook our way through here. We need to keep, keep these... Oh, yeah, it's blowing just right, so our fire's relatively safe for the moment. I guarantee nothing, though. But, yeah, so if you follow this trail to the end and kind of hang a left over by kind of by those hills there's a pretty decent deer spawn over there and there's a trail that you can follow kind of right up in the middle it's uh something something hideout or something like that it's named after somebody but i found rabbit up there i found deer up there it always seems to be a good spot Oh, here it comes. Uh, let's just at least get these last two steaks cooked. I don't know whether the fire's going to make it. Oh, no, okay. We're making it. Cooking in a blizzard. We got this. Let's get all this meat cooked. Then we don't have to screw around with it. We're helping our cooking skill. cook and then the nice part once it's cooked you don't smell nearly as bad if you're cooking if you're carrying around raw meat you pick one up you you instantly get those those stink marks like that i think you can carry two pieces of cooked venison before you get the, the old stank penalty uh how are we on water we can drink uh 2.5 liters yeah we can drink a bit All right, cooking with Agent Shu. Have you learned anything? Special recipes? I haven't told you what, what seasonings we like to put on our venison or anything, but that's okay. You know, season to taste. Okay. Let's come on over here and we'll drop all but two. Drop, 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 drop. Uh, let's pick up one. So yeah, now that I'm, I've got two, I've, I've got no, no stinky marks on me. Uh, what do we got here? What can we? Well, while we got the fire, we should be able to repair some stuff. So, uh, wow. Well, okay, let's put these gloves on. Okay, these are really good. So that sweater doesn't do us any good. But we definitely want to put some pants back on. I'm surprised we're not freezing with that on. We got this. Should we double scarf it? Uh, yeah, let's double scarf it. Extra, extra warm around the neck. Oh, even though I think we'll get frostbite on our ears if that's not covered. So maybe we'll put the cotton toque on. Yeah, let's do that. We can put the cotton... That's a, yeah, ragged cotton toque. That's fine. We'll wear that. We'll say our ears are covered. We won't get frostbite. But if we're going to repair, we may as well put more water on here. Need the sunlight to repair, unfortunately. So we got to keep burning some wood. Uh, or coal? Ah, uh, we only have one left. Okay. Now let's see what it takes to repair. That we got to repair. Wow, wow. Let's repair it. It takes how long? 30 minutes. Let's do it. It failed. That sucks. How long did that... How much of my fire did that eat? Uh, let's try it again. Repairing by firelight. Not the most uh, effective, I guess. Okay, well that was potable, so we're good there. Let's add some more wood. Get some more water. A 
Now what else can we repair? I mean, it's, we're still only at 29% after that repair, but that's better than nothing. We'll repair the cotton toque. All right, so we got to break down. We'll break down this dress shirt. 10 minutes, perfect. Tear that apart. That'll give us some more repair material. What do we want? We we're going to do the cotton toque. Let's repair that. What's this? 30 minutes? Let's do it. Unfortunately, because we had to, uh, 21 minutes till boil dry. Because it took us so long just to kind of kill time to heal up and sleep half the day away. We're right back into a night cycle. Um, 74, 73. We should repair that some more. 77, 64. These, these pants are whooped. I should fix those. And I definitely got to fix the socks. I don't really want to because these socks are pretty terrible. But... You can't craft socks, so you're better off fixing them. Uh, we're going to rip this apart. Actions, harvest, 45, do it. Mm. Didn't I put more water on? Add fuel. One more? Yeah, we'll add one more. That's fine. Now let's repair... What was I going to repair? The jeans? Or the socks? And... Uh, no, 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 no. Oh, let's do the socks. Yeah, the climbing socks, I, or the climber's socks, I think, are the best. Whereas... You, the, the wool socks are still good. They're just not as good as the climbing socks. Still got plenty of time. Is there anything else we can break down? I'm breaking down all of these clothes that really could end up saving our butt later on. But I'm trying to just break down like these t-shirts that don't give you much insulation anyway. Four minutes until boiled. We can repair something. Oh yeah, shoot. We can break all of these down. What am I doing? I'm breaking down good clothes when I've got damaged stuff here. Derp. That's fine. That just means I will have more cloth for later. Oh, I guess I am breaking some of them down. All right, we'll take this water. We should be good on water for a while. Oh, yeah, 4.83 liters. We're going to be heavy. That's fine. How much time do we have left? we got more than enough time to sit here and break these down. It stinks. That was a good hat, too. Well, at least the bear didn't kill us. We got to the lighthouse. That's always a plus. This fire's going to go out. Is it? That only took... Oh, the fire's still going. Um, What time is it? And I'm halfway through. You know what? Let's take this torch. I'm going to head inside. Knock out for the night. And get as much sleep as we can. Our health should be back to full if we do that. And then... Maybe we go on the hunt. Get get a yeah. Maybe we should do that. We should go out and get a bunch of rabbits and get ready for the rabbit skin hat. Cause I mean that's only six percent cured, and I think we need three more wolf pelts. Even though there is a dead one right out there that I can harvest. All right, let's use up some of this water. And is there something small I can eat? Yeah, we eat the granola bar. Now, as far as the wolf meat goes, I will eat it. I just won't eat much of it in a shot. I'll just eat, like, one piece a day. So before I leave for my day's run, I'll eat a piece and then take two pieces of deer meat with me. And that, that seems to work out pretty well. By the next day, your parasite risk is gone, and you can just rinse and repeat until you have a large supply of meat, whether you did really good on a, on a deer hunt or you just happen to get cooking five and you're getting bear meat left and right, or you're lucky, and I shouldn't say lucky, if you're good, <laughs> better better to be good than lucky, but if you're good and you happen to come across the moose and take it down. 
So let's eat this deer. And we might go down and harvest that wolf pelt. I keep calling them pelts. They are hides, correct? Oh, there's rose hips right here. I'll take those. These might even need them with the way I'm losing temperature. Now I could make the run across the ravine. I mean, there are some cars over there. What's that? Wolf there. I just saw a wolf. There's another wolf there. Well, the wolves are out in force. I don't stink, do I? No. I could make the run over to ravine. But I don't think there's going to be much over there in the way of loot. The transition cave might have some loot. Just because there's some crates in there and some lockers. But did I drop anything? Mm -mm -mm. The church didn't have anything. Boy, now I can't remember. Oh, there's a couple. Oh, the wolf's getting the deer. Oh, he's trying. Oh, no. Wolf gave up. Oh, no. He's going after it. There he goes. Boy, wouldn't that be nice? If that was closer, I'd creep up on the wolf, kill the wolf, and steal the deer. Alas, it's a ways over there. And that doesn't... From a distance, anyway, it doesn't even look like that wolf's going to get it. Yeah, I may have... I don't know. I can make a fire... And, well, last time I thought the fire was going to protect me from everything. And it turns out a bear had different ideas. Oh, no. I want the torch. I'm going to start a fire. Just a short one next to this guy. All I really want is its hiding guts. All right. Let's light this. Fire starting three would be so nice, then I wouldn't have to worry about Tinder anymore. Oh, please, really? Come on. Come on, little fire. Oh. Pick it up. Uh, no. We want fire, not torch. Oh, and I need Tinder. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Okay, let's do this. And we're going to... Go here. We got more than enough wood. We'll harvest that. May have to burn another match to relay the torch, but that's fine. And wasteful with matches. You can tell I'm not playing interloper. I know, Astrid. It's chilly. We're trying to get a fire going, babe. It's okay. I know. Alright, let's get this hide. Okay, repair skill is... So... I guess I don't quite understand how my repair skill is affected by making tinder plugs. That doesn't make a whole lot of sense to me. I mean, maybe it's a thing. Maybe it does affect your repair skill. But it doesn't really... It shouldn't, I wouldn't think. But well, whatever, I mean, if it's a thing, it's a thing. Or maybe, you know, repair skill is just like overall crafting skill. Come on, little fire. Which, okay. I guess that would make sense. Let's go. Come on, little fire. You can do it. I believe in you. And I think to take the wolf hide, it's going to take an hour. Hide one hour. All right, let's go. Oh, jeez, just jump on the fire away, don't we? Should I put? You know, I'm gonna put this piece of coal on here just to get some heat out of the fire. And then let's look around. No bear. No bear. Okay. Okay. Cooperate this time, bear. I don't think I'll be able to survive you twice in a row. Oh, the sounds are kind of nasty. Alright. Uh, I think I have... Because I got a ton of... Well, no, you know what? We're here. I think the guts take another hour. We're going to put this guy on. 
and then we're just gonna go for it. I know I said that last time and it didn't end well, but we're hoping for a different outcome this time. All right, we got some guts, now we stink. Let's make our way back up top, drop our goods off. And then we have some daylight. Let's, we're gonna foot track over there where that wolf was. Because if we can find a relatively fresh kill. Oh, you didn't learn from your buddy? All right, come on. I need all your hides, so you can. We can do this. Oh wow, I you were going for a swim there. Come on, come on. Did I miss that second shot? Oh, that stinks. What a waste. Well, I know he's hit, so I don't believe he'll be surviving very long. And I don't even know. Maybe I hit him the second time. All right, let's pick up all of our brass. I do got to be somewhat careful with how much ammo I use. Is he hit? I went right up here. Hey, didn't I just hit you? Seriously? Are you like the invincible wolf? I'm pretty sure I just got him in the head. Pretty sure. I could be wrong. Never been one for first person shooters, so my aim isn't the best. All right, so we have four wolf, four wolf hide. I think it's three deer hide for the pants. And then depending on whether it's the rabbit skin gloves or hat, it would be three or four. The hat being, f no, the gloves being four and then the hat being three, I think. I could be wrong. All right, let's put this wolf hide down. Okay, that's fine. Should put the guts up on the second floor just so I'm not staring at <laughs> animal guts all over the floor. It just seems nasty to me. All right, so you know what? I think I'm going to grab something to drink. I'm going to end it there. Next episode, we're going to go hunting some more animals. Hopefully, we can get a deer, some more wolf hide, and we're going to go looking for that bear. I'm hoping it bled out. I guarantee nothing, but here's the hope so if you guys like what you see please leave a like and subscribe it's greatly appreciated and i will see you guys in the next one later